Good. Well, tonight we want to remember a friend we lost recently here at News 2. He didn't work at News 2, but he was part of our family. His name is Clarence Kuykendall. I know many of you know Clarence and will miss him terribly. He was one of the most down-to-earth, genuine, caring people you will ever meet. For those of you who don't know Clarence, let me tell you a little bit about him. I first met Clarence as a member of the Knights of Pythias, a group that reached out years ago and wanted to come and donate bikes to Toys for Tots. The group came by. We helped them unload their bikes, their trikes, and their scooters. Clarence was one of those members. We chatted about Toys for Tots, and in our chat, I told Clarence we actually go out on Christmas morning to deliver additional toys. Clarence, who just happens to favor Santa Claus with a big white beard and a perfect body, wanted to come. The rest is history. Clarence came out every Christmas morning for years. Cold, hot, sunshine, rain, windy, he was there and by far was the most popular person to knock on doors bright and early on Christmas. Clarence, or Santa as we called him, brought so many smiles and so much joy to young and old, year after year after year. I'm so glad we got a chance to spend one more year with Santa this past Christmas morning. Clarence, a job well done, my friend. We will take it from here. The Knights of Pythias is taking donation in Clarence's memory to continue its Toys for Tots donation tradition. You can send your checks to Knights of Pythias, 1968 Belgrade Avenue, Charleston, 29407. Just include in the memo line, Toys for Tots. Yeah, Rob, well said, and uh, certainly he will be missed. Of course, so many people were involved in Toys for Tots, so many great people to come in year in and year out, but Clarence, Santa was always there. Yes. Rob's, probably the only guy That's that right. they wanted to get more pictures with was Santa than Rob. <laughs> Close first and second, but boy, uh, was Santa was out there, and he, he, he was. will certainly be missed for sure. And, and when you think about community and what it means to be a part of a community, it's because of our traditions, sure. and he was a big part of our tradition in this community with Toys for Tots, certainly a big part of the tradition in my and our family mm -hmm. being with that group every morning and seeing his face and I Rob you know what sincerely mean to get that picture every year with him <laughs> we would find you but everyone was really looking for him he made every child feel special well, and I on a personal up. note sure he made my little girl feel very special every year he was so proud of Reese and encouraged yes. every child when he went into those homes he will certainly be missed and he deserves all the celebration yes. we are giving him she does all right stay with us we're coming back after the break <laughs> 